We were just talking about Rihanna and how sexy she is. We were, we were. What did she literally do with a jean, with jeans? Apparently she turned it into a She made a jeans, a jeans, a jean string. Not a jean string, a jean string. Now a jean string, if you have a, sorry, that was Matt just walking in, opening the door and made noise. Thanks a lot for that, Matt. Uh, yeah, a jean string. So basically what it is, it's a jean string, but it's in the material of jeans. Do you feel this is acceptable for life and for females and people like Carly should potentially adopt I something mean, similar? Let me see Carly, what's going on? No, no, I'm looking, I was looking at you to see if you could do the jean string. I think she can do it. She can, she has wonderful red hair. Her breasts are quite perky and I feel that her eyes are quite seductive. I feel like it's an ocean of love that I would love to just swim in. All of that. Do you like to swim? No, I can swim 50 meters, but after that it gets a bit... Black people, Africa, yeah, black people can't really swim. I've got hair, if it shrinks up, I've next thing you know. I've got them dense bones. It's not worth, I'm skinny though, but I've got dense bones. Innit? Sure? Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. That's what my mum told me anyway. So. Do you know what? We haven't even formally been introduced. What is your name? It's Nate. I'm here with Nate. We should have introduced ourselves quite earlier, but we didn't. I heard you just come on stage. I did. How was it? Yeah, it was fun. I enjoyed myself. So uh, talk to us a bit about, for people that are ignorant like myself, about your material and uh, what type of uh, demographic you'd like to appeal to. I mean, I don't know how to describe material. Normally, you know what kind of box to put me in. Do you know what I'm saying? Like I dropped the Ah, fuck a box. We don't want to be in a box. What do you like? What's your music represent? What's it all about? It just represents like progression, you know, being innovative, like getting on beats people you really wouldn't really get on, you know, like referencing certain bits of culture that people kind of like go unnoticed and that. Like right now I'm touching on a lot of garbage stuff like right now, innit? My old oh. like, you know, it's pretty much real rappy, real like, uh, it's quite floaty though, quite nice beats. Play on this garage thing. I can't live. Well, like the little skip, you know, on the off snare, it's like, so you produce? No, 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 I just like that bit, innit? Oh, that's a bloody hell, you're all rounder, innit? Look I'm at you. I'm my shits, man, I'll go in. So uh, what can we, ex this is the question that all people ask in the presenting world, because we don't really have many questions, but this is the one that like, if we're running out of questions, just grasp onto that one. Yeah. What can we expect from you from this year? It's really conventional, I'd like to apologise, because no, everyone's going to ask you. It's, it's a bit yeah. fucked no, up. No, oh, everyone's going to ask that, innit? No, I'm it's cool. Um, I'm dropping a new mixtape. Yeah. But since you're a lot ignorant to what I do, you go onto the internet, the Google, and you know, that white thing, type in Isnate. White. Because like, racist. Videos. Yeah. There's videos from Isnate there. I just shot a remix with G Fresh called Where She Learned That. He jumped on that. It's a big single of mine. Like, you know, the underground bit. Like, I dropped in like last summertime. He just jumped on it. Like, give it a bit more energy. Got Milk Belly on there. No, go. Got Phase One on there. Got Ash Catchum, myself, the Beat Knox. So, that sounds quite pretty exciting if I'm being totally honest with you. I feel like I'm losing out. I'm missing out. Po, you're missing out cuz. Cuz I'm aware of shit in it and you're on your thing, but you are, you're missing out cuz. Well, we're fully aware I'm missing out. A bit like my father's missing out on my life. So, uh, yeah, he disappeared. Me too, it's cool. Yeah, he was going to the shop, didn't really return. I thought he was gonna like bring some organic milk or something back for us to share amongst our cereal, but he didn't bring it back. No milk still now. Yeah. I kind of like milk with sugar puff over there. He's a really nice person as well. Um, just talk to him. It's really nice. Um, what message could you give to my dad just to close this interview? Go and watch my video. Boom. It's Nate. Where's she learning that at? You'll love it. Your son's going to check it out and dig it. Bring that milk back. La la la. So, we're going to close the interview with Bring Milk Back Dad. Watch Nate's videos. And if you care to mention, just give us a little contact on Facebook or something. Bye everyone on life with eyes and mouths and noses and you smell stuff. Goodbye.